All right, Batman fans, welcome. Today we are taking a look at my personal favorite four Batman bat suits from Nexus Mods. So these are bat suits that the Arkham Knight community has so graciously worked on, and we'll be using them in the DLC expansion. So that's four different bat suits for four different story expansions. We're starting with the Suicide Squad Kill the Justice League suit, and then we'll be jumping into the Hush suit, and then Batman Forever, and then Zero Year. Master Bruce, it appears when the airship crash landed, two guards did indeed parachute to, uh, well, I hesitate to say safety, sir. I know you're safe. Thank you. That monster deserves to be put down. There's only one monster here. You're insane! Get your hands off me! You experimented on him, tortured these men. I'm not begging forgiveness. So I just wanted to point out here that we are using a graphics mod. If you were to do a side-by-side -side comparison, you could really see, but just the lighting and shadows are so good with this graphics mod. However, I wouldn't recommend it if you have anything less than a 3080, because as we can see in the top right corner here, with 3080, I'm able to get, you know, 2K ultra settings with the graphics mod at roughly 30 to 40 frames per second, which is actually cut in half from what it usually would be. Usually I would be around 70 to 80 frames, you know, we're at 30 to 40 here. And I don't think it's so bad that I won't use it, but uh, again, I certainly wouldn't recommend it. And I personally wouldn't be using it if I had anything less than a 3080. So all of these bat suits are available in the description of this video. There is a link that will take you directly to them and you can download them for yourself. Make sure to show the modders uh, some love and appreciation for giving Batman Arkham Knight a bit of a resurgence, right? Because there was a time where I legitimately thought that the modding community had completely moved on from Batman Arkham Knight because there has just been for years, years and years, so many bat suits just completely left on the table. But when Spider-Man Remastered uh, came out on PC, that game was really getting all of the great Spidey suits from the modding community. And I was just, you know, kind of just wishing that we had gotten the same for Arkham Knight. And yeah, it seems like we finally are now. And it really just inspired me to make this video and to showcase and highlight, you know, all the amazing work that the Arkham Knight modding community is doing. and. You know, I'm personally so thankful because this is what I've wanted from Arkham Knight for so long. I mean, look at the white eyes on this hush suit. It's, uh, in my opinion, better than what we saw in Arkham City because these ones actually glow. So it's like little details like that, um, which go such a long way. Down the rabbit hole you fall where madness reigns from wall to wall. But don't get me wrong, I mean, there's still a lot of great bat suits that we just don't really have yet. As we'll soon see, the Zero Year suit from the Capullo and Snyder run uh, is incredible in this game. But, you know, I've always really wanted just the uh, baseline Capullo oh, suit. What? No, I had you. Don't you see? You're mad. You're mad. You're just like me. I'll never be like you, Jervis. Let's take a moment to appreciate how good Arkham Knight looks for, what, 2015, I think it was? So this is a nine-year-old game looking better than, I mean, at least in my opinion, Suicide Squad Kill the Justice League, which just came out, also by Rocksteady. So if Suicide Squad Kill the Justice League did anything right, it at least made the modding community take a look back at Arkham Knight, you know, to give it all this love and appreciation that I think we can maybe all agree that it didn't initially get. Yeah, the Batman Forever sonar suit really does look good in this game. If you're on Twitter, by the way, make sure to tweet out the hashtag release the Schumacher cut because there's an alternate cut of Batman Forever Victor. Uh, that Warner Bros. is keeping from us. They wanted me to join them, help fight you. I refused, so they took her. They took Nora because of you. She'll die without my care. But they said they'll return her in exchange for Batman. Warning, cryogenerator unstable. 
If you trust them, Victor, take your shot. Warning, cryogenerator unstable. Please. And I would certainly not be taking advantage of my time here if I didn't just briefly mention my just overall disappointment at Rocksteady for Suicide Squad Kill the Justice League. This is a games as a service looter shooter game, which, you know, is something at least as a DC fan, I never wanted from a triple A, you know, DC development studio. It was, it was just such an opportunity to do another next gen Arkham game. You know, maybe we could have gotten a Justice League game or a Batman Beyond game. But instead, you know, we get a, uh, you know, something as corporate as uh, a Suicide Squad game. What you're essentially doing in the game is, yeah, it's what the title suggests. You're killing off you know, the franchise that people loved. And you're introducing the rest of the Justice League, you know, as a as a device that uh, you as these characters that I don't think anyone like cares too much about um, are essentially killing. So it's just it's just kind of like it's it's like a subversion of what people wanted, but like in a very tacky way, I would say. Speaking to me. Then you know what he's become. Batman, where is she? Have you found her? She's here, Victor. Victor! Oh my god, no! Massive explosion in the bay. We have to go, now. So again, back to the zero year suit that I previously mentioned. Really love this suit. It's from the New 52 Scott Snyder and Greg Capullo Batman run. I've always been like a huge fan of the, uh, just like the baseline suit from that comic book series. And I know Rocksteady did their, you know, quote, take on it with the New 52 suit, but I think there's just so much improvements that can be made to it, such as you know, the cowl, the chest emblem, those things can definitely be improved to more accurately reflect Greg Capullo's artwork. I don't really know anything about modding, and I'm sure this would be an incredibly difficult task, but to get the cape Alfred, more, you know, in front of the suit, sort of how it is in those Greg Capullo comics would be, yeah, just really, really amazing. Um, and yeah, the zero year suit, uh, just makes me want it even more now. Rage. You dare approach Rache Al Ghul? You've brought him back too many times. The Lazarus Dream's all that's keeping him alive. He will rise again. Sheathe your blade. There will be no fighting here. I want you gone by morning. The rebels have found another pit, a purer source. A sample of his essence is all he would need. I won't help you revive him. So yeah, guys, before we end the video, feel free to follow me on Twitter. It's the Batman artist. Talk about DC comics, video games, anime, all types of, uh, you know, stuff happening in pop culture. And my Instagram is the Batman artist as well. There you'll see, you know, my Batman cosplay photos. They're art projects that are constantly developing over time into a portfolio of work that I think at the end of the day can stand the test of time within everything that people have contributed to the Batman character. Turn around slowly and hand me the detonator. Nissa. Thank you, Bruce. Does Raish know his daughter fights for the rebels? 
the rebels fight for me. But with him gone, the League will be mine. And it will shed no more innocent blood. The assassins will leave Gotham, never to return. How can I trust you? I swear by the woman we both loved. I swear on my sister's grave. I will win this war, Dark Knight. It's up to you how long it rages for. Also, let me know, do you like these types of videos? Do you want to see more Batman Arkham Knight from me? Maybe we can showcase other modded suits that I didn't get the chance to showcase in this specific video because there are so many cool ones. Let me know. Um, hit me up in the comments and yeah, whatever you guys want to see. Uh, I'm always down to make Batman content. So if Arkham Knight is something we want to see more of uh, for me specifically, then I would love to do it. You weren't a good man, Ray. But you had conviction. Stop him! Kill him! So yeah, that is all of the Batman Arkham Knight uh, main DLC missions. So good, by the way. If you have not played them, you absolutely should. This was just a small taste of, of what they offered. Nissa, don't make me regret this, or you will. So, really cool. Let me know what your guys' favorite modded bat suit is from what was showcased in this video. What bat suits do you want to see modded into Arkham Knight? Let's talk about it. All right, Batman fans, until the next one. <laughs>